Hello, my name is Jupiter Hadley, and today we're doing another version of Jupiter Plays All the Games, this time with the Halloween Jam 2016. This was a game jam that inspired developers to make spooky or horror games around the theme Fear. I'm playing all of the games that were entered for about a minute each, 10 games per video, links to the individual games in the description so you can check them out further. And at the end, there'll be an article of my favorites on Game Jolt's Fireside. Um, if you want to check me out, all my info is also in the description. Thank you very much for watching, liking, and commenting. Next. We're playing Exit. I have played this before for the GBGM5, but shall I play it again? Alright. Can you hear my breathing? This game. A bit scary. A bit scary feeling. Ooh. There's another door that says exit. Oh, there's this first. Alright. Go to the exit door. You need the key. You need the key. Alright. If I was a key, where would I be? On the table. Space. Okay. Don't worry. Doors that, you know, are emergency exits definitely should be locked with keys. Oh, this is getting, like, scary sounding. Those look like little buttons, maybe? What? Oh, wait, it's like a pipe. Yeah, okay. One, alright. Very creepy atmosphere. Oh! Where is it? Pause itself on the table. Okay. More stairs. This is a strange house. Next. We're playing coffin counseling. Up it is down and ugly is beautiful. Move those dear arrow keys and rack to space. Oh. Up is down and down is up. Hey you, Lord Dracula is feeling depressed. He ate his therapist. Why? Now everyone is feeling down and nobody is terrorizing the country. You were chosen as the new therapist for the Lord. Get on it. Up is down. Oh, it's actually space that's allowing us to go up and down. Yes, yes, yes. I'm trying. There's a lot of stuff going on. Okay. Who's that? Oh my god, I'm just... I'm so depressed, I just can't take it. Really? I mean, why? Of course, I meant to, didn't mean to hit that. I just wish there was more to life than work. Hobbies. You're right, I always wanted to try masculation. Thanks, I feel better now. Eh, I'm sure that'll all work out well. I like the way we travel around this place. Nobody understands me, I just want to roll up and stuff into giant balls and hurl them into space. Uh, is that so much to ask? Yeah, I mean, probably. I'm a game developer, but I think my game is going to be shit. Oh, it's random encounters with weird people to solve their problems. Should I even try to finish this? Is it worth the time? Uh, experience and joy. Yeah, experience and joy. You're all right. I don't want my work to disappear in a drawer. Time to go back to work and finish this. <laughs> Aw. I like meeting these people and trying to solve their, their issues. The graphics are also really lovely. Next. We're playing Relictus. WSD and mouse. Got it. This looks kind of creepy. Eat interact. Alright. Probably this. Anything that's sparking should I interact with you. Maybe. Oh, that. Ah, that opened up this like terminal area. Okay, the lighting here is quite dim. <laughs> A bit creepy. Should we go this way first? Turn that off. Lots of oh leave. Okay. Do have to tell me twice? Uh, 
that doesn't sound good. Oh, this way. Okay. Where's the flashlight? I don't know where it is. I feel like this isn't good at all. Next. We're playing Carnival Horror. You've been wanting to go to the carnival all year. Finally, it's come to town, and you are so excited to explore the different tents and get tickets along the way. Maze, find three skulls before the fear meter gets to zero. Haunted trails, transverse the haunted house without the fear meter getting to zero. Okay, escape to go to menu. Let's do escape. Do you want to exit to the main menu? Yes, play. Oh, so we don't have to stick on these paths. All right, so here's the maze. To get out before we're too scared. I like the look of our character. Oh, there's nothing scary about this house right now. It's fine. There's just music. Nothing scary about music. I'm probably not going to make it out of here. I feel like I've, yeah, I've already gone the wrong way. That's what the scare meter was trying to tell me. That I was going the wrong way. It's a very tiny window, so you don't see very much in the maze ahead of time. Which is probably by design. Hopefully this is the right way. Uh. Hmm. How big is this maze? There's a skeleton. That's probably bad. Oh wait, do we collect skeletons? Find three skulls. Yeah, that's what we have to do. Oh, okay, so at least that gives us more, um courage. Alright. Next. We're playing Sir Look Behind You. Sorry you have to see my recording thing and this activate windows or whatever. Um, sir, please look now. Life signs detected. Turn around. No. Uh. No. So what... Oh, it auto closes. What you need to do is click on the spots of red hoping they go away. So your computer is saying look behind you, and you don't want to, so you click this red stuff. So that you can not go there. You just have to be fast. Life sign detectors. No, it's fine. Nothing bad's happening. Nope. Nope. I'm working. Go away. That's the idea. It's a simple game, but it's well made. The sound's a bit weird. It's like tapping almost. Goodbye, computer. <laughs> We're playing Dormonica. Alright, it's so thoughts. Level generation is crazy. Random tunneling system. I could instead preload. Oh, so this is like thoughts on what they're doing. Oh, okay, developer thoughts. I'll just hit play. See what happens. Name. Alright, Jupiter. Sure. It's ready. Demonic requires enabled. You have to run that. Okay. Should be fine. Okay, there's a thing there that we can kill. Ooh. Let's, yeah. Go back to this. He's like shooting at me. There we go. No target visible. He hit me. I hit killing it. I hit the ghoul at one. So we don't have. Let's rest. If we rest, we get things better. We've got a lot of items. One scroll of anodite, blah, blah, blah. This one, scroll of... Nope. What? Scroll of antidote? Let's read that, maybe. Didn't really do anything. Just hoping to get some health, maybe. All right, we shall turn around. Go towards one of these doors. Looks to be a monster of that. I'm just trying to fight monsters. Oh, wait, that's a chest. We found a key. Oh, we have to turn around. What about that door? Um, this door is locked. Key. Unlock. Okay. There's a dog there. I can see it. Oh, it's like a weird dog that throws slime at me. I'm poisoned. I'm dead. <laughs> well, that was a very interesting game. <laughs> I didn't do well at it. Next. We're playing Spider Fight. 
Um, we apologize for how crappy this game is. Welcome to this game. It's me, Fritchio. Alright. It's currently in a demo stage, like a very early demo stage. So, I think we can only shoot downwards. Alright, we shot the spiders. Then move down, and there are more spiders. We'll go this way so that we can shoot some more spiders. These ones aren't moving though. They aren't even trying to get away. Let's go back and shoot those ones as well. It's very simple so far, but it's the right start. You've got enemies, you've got character movement, you're shooting. The enemies die properly. There's some music. Like an exterminator killing some spiders. I'm not sure how I'm going to kill these ones because I have to kind of get up and over them. Ah, there we go. This one's moving quite fast, though. Nope, back to the start. <laughs> Next. We're playing The Witching Hour. Oh, I should hit New Game. Yeah, I don't have a game to load. Like my mouse is like a little skeleton hand. Alright, someone was just thrown. Prince Septimus. Hey, are you alright? You okay? Oh, his head's weird. Hi. Oh. Why are you fighting me? I'm a child. What the heck? I was just coming to see if you were alright. Punching bag. Golden egg punching bag. Can we, like, fight? I don't know. I can jump. Stop fighting me. I don't like this. These graphics look great. I ran into a pumpkin. Now I'm inside a house. Hi. I would like to learn how to fight. Some guy with a strange head. I can't seem to go in there. Some guy with a strange head keeps messing with me. Now I'm in a haunted house. Ooh, I can kind of clip through the walls. over there. This game looks really nice. Just wish I knew what I meant what I'm meant to be doing. What's in here? Just that paper? I can't like turn around oh wait there we go. You gotta click and drag presents. Hmm next we're playing. We're playing Collect Apocalypse. It's, uh, I guess, sort of like a Pac-Man style game. I need to pick up the gun. Where it's a zombie apocalypse. Ah, oh, darn it! And we need to collect stuff as fast as possible. Let's go and get this gun. They like are drawn straight towards you. But you have to try to collect as much as you can. Ah, darn it. It's a bit weird. The movement doesn't seem quite right. Ah, move. Okay. I don't have another gun. Nope. <laughs> Next. We're playing human. Following footage is captured during an attempt to hack and record a government video stream. Previously captured footage suggests that the man filming, Paul, works for a secret sector of a frequently tested facility located deep in the Alaskan wilderness. The program is no longer being funded, thus Paul is sent to notify the employees and have them leave the premises to his leave his hand, uh, premises to his superior monitor that unfolds once he arrives. Take the liberty of subtitling the video, but other than that, footage is completely undoctored. Okay. Here, yeah, me, Paul, write this, and I want you to get inside and find the workers and notify them of our funding issue. If they ask any questions, we'll get the equipment moved out later. Just get them out of there for now. We want you to get back and find the antennas. Get to the back, find the antennas, and turn off power supplies. It's very important. Do not forget before you leave. Oh, uh, so we're actually in the video. I thought we were going to watch a creepy video. That's not happening. We're being a part of a creepy video. Ugh. 
Of course, it's snowy. It's Alaska. It's out in the middle of nowhere. Building doesn't look very well maintained. I don't like this. I really don't like scary games. Which makes this the perfect jam for me, right? Get to the back. Right, mouse button to zoom in. Although our focus in the last few years has been primarily in oil research, we have observed a notable difference in the climate since our research began nearly a decade ago. All right. I don't know. Like a little key card. Yeah, it's a key card. Is that a key card? Got it. Doesn't sound very good. Alright, if you want to explore a creepy science lab, go for it. Figure out what happened and save everyone. Uh, next.